Well, hi guys, and welcome back. So, it has been a very eventful week. So, yeah, I'm breaking out these tiny but mighty sticker books. Um, I believe they are the Lovely Pastels, which, yeah, is this one, which I'm just going to go ahead and dig through and try to find some frames since this is my wellness layout and I do generally uh, journal in it. So I'm just going to try to find some frames here and we're going to create our own box stickers, which, yeah, I forgot how like super gorgeous these are. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I always forget about my tiny sticker books and look, he has a buddy. So yeah, maybe I might put one on each page and so yeah, I don't know what it is. Like something tells me that I need to start like looking through the sticker books that I already have because I mean I don't know I was organizing the craft room the other day and it, it was just like wow like I completely forgot that I even had this stuff <laughs> so this is the tiny version of the fun florals and yeah like I'm even I'm going out of my comfort zone here because I love the floral sticker books I do but as you can tell I don't use them. <laughs> they scare me. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I'm just so intimidated by them. And like I see everybody else use them and their spreads look super gorgeous. And then when I go to use it, it just looks like crap. So <laughs> sorry guys, there wasn't a better way of putting it. <laughs> So I'm challenging myself this week that I will create one that looks decent. So I think what I've been doing in the past is I've been like going overboard with the stickies. So I'm going to try to keep this as simple as possible, which, oh my God, I love this one. And look, it's almost like that pink. So heck yeah. But just to spread the pink around the page, we are going to put them on the other side and I'm actually wondering now if I have any like borders in here that are close to that pink. Which, okay, we have like this real light pink. It's probably not going to be in here since this is the pastels book. But, I mean, uh, there, then there's that teal. Which I do want to use that teal. I don't know, I might come back to that. And, I mean, there's another one. Mm -mm -mm -mm. what to do okay <laughs> which okay this one does it does match but I don't know about it being like not not a full border so uh, I'm gonna put him in there we're gonna think about this so I know I'm at least using these two right here so uh, let's figure out where we're gonna put these <laughs> baby steps and yes I am using these fun quotes from Alicia's shop <laughs> they uh to me I think that's gonna help me keep this simple I'll add like a flower here and there and then I'll throw in some of her quotes and then we're gonna be done so this should be quick easy and hopefully painless so let's see here we're gonna move this up here which you know, I'm actually wondering, should I just use the boxes of those stickers? But then again, like, it's only going to give me four writing spots. But, I mean, like, hey, if this week is anything like last week, oh, God, less is more. <laughs> so, let's dig through this. Okay, so here we go. And for some reason, I feel like people call these the sugar and spice flowers, which... I'm not quite sure why or how they got their name, <laughs> but I swear every time I see these, everyone's like, oh, sugar and spice. I just think they're adorable. <laughs> they're simple and they're adorable. So, all right, let's see here. I'm breaking out the colorful boxes now because, okay, I could use black, but then again, it's just, eh. So I'm thinking I got to keep this thing colorful. Which, mm, do I have that teal in here? Okay, so that teal does exist. 
Let's see if we can find it in one of the larger stickers. And look at that, guys, right there in that big sticker right there. And it's a border, too, so I'm not going to feel guilty. So, heck yeah, we're just going to take that. Which, oh, my God, he has, like, little buddies, too. But I think I just want this guy. I'm going to take these guys out just in case. I might. Uh, I don't know. Like, something's telling me just keep this simple. <laughs> I mean, I'm telling you right now, if this is seriously a week like last week, <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> I can't take any more. I just want to go back to normal. <laughs> Shift wise and everything else. <laughs> okay. And yeah, that purple, I mean, even though that dark purple is a very gorgeous shade, it does not match what I got going on on the page. So we're just going to put you to the side. And where are my scissors? <laughs> uh, guys, I'm at a loss. Like, uh, okay, well, let's see here. The scissors aren't where they're supposed to be. So let's try to figure out what it is I'm going to use. So, like, this is what I was talking about before. Like, I could use these because they do match. But then, to me, it just feels like it'd be too much of the same. Like, there's not enough variety. So, mm. yeah. Okay, so we're just going to put those over there. Maybe this ombre one. Because, you know, I mean, it is about the same size. We'll just tilt it to its side like this. And... Where's that bigger tail one at? Right here. Okay, so maybe have this guy go across the top of this page over here. And, I mean, I'm going to have to figure something out for that bottom corner. But I'll get to that when the time comes. But, yeah, I'm thinking I'm just going to stick with this. So, okay, so here's my label paper. And I will be right back. I got to try to find my sissies. <laughs> Oh my god, excuse me guys. <laughs> we had extreme sanitation at work this week, so my throat is feeling it. Okay, there we go. Found this disease. <laughs> so let's go ahead and we're going to get this done. <laughs> Which, okay, I hope that all of you are having like a wonderful time. Like seriously, I wish that you had like a peaceful week. I wish that there was nothing too stressful. <laughs> uh, I mean, there's got to be someone out there that had, like, the best week ever. There has to be. <laughs> I mean, the painting is going really well. And I will admit, like, the setup of this planner, like, I like it more than what I actually thought that I would. I thought that I would get tired of it by now and I would start covering up, like, that bottom box layer. But... I mean, it is working. <laughs> I love how I have that little area to like reflect on the day and just be like, did I do it? <laughs> did I at least make a try? <laughs> did I suck horribly at it? <laughs> or did I like extremely kill that goal for the day? So, I mean, those are my favorite days. And, um... <coughs> Oh my god, I'm so sorry. It is so dry. Um, but yeah, this week in the watercolor challenge, uh, it was in fact just that. It was extremely challenging. <laughs> I got my butt kicked by clouds. <laughs> Something that I thought would be so simple. And it was not. <laughs> Them little... White, fluffy, wispy things that look so beautiful in the sky <laughs> are a pain in the you-know-what to paint. <laughs> Definitely with watercolors, where you literally have to paint around the object if it's white, because, you know, watercolors. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> so if you mess up, you're done. <laughs> And that I did. So, but see, hey, I didn't mess up when I was making these stickies. <laughs> so, at least I could do one thing. <laughs> I got something going for me, right? <laughs> okay, so I just got to finish snipping this off of 
that white label paper there and okay I am using there's like a uh, use sticker sheet down here below and I'm kind of using it to uh, figure out how I want like the little floral stickers which I will show you here in a moment <coughs> oh wow guys <laughs> I am so glad that I reduced my plan with me is to two. <laughs> okay, so see, this is what I was talking about here. So I'm going to put this one down here. And from what I could tell, at least from the layouts that I like looking at that are florals, is the box goes over the flowers. So maybe that's what I've been doing wrong. And I mean, I've been trying to like layer the whole like border of the box with flowers so I think it's like a little too overpowering. So I'm just gonna put one here on the corner and we're gonna say, okay, that's it for you. Now, I mean, I probably should have not put those boxes down before doing the flowers. Something tells me I might regret that really soon, but hey, you know what? We're just gonna go with it. We're just going to peel up a corner and we're just going to pick one. And I'm thinking, I'm just going to take, yeah, this lovely teal color here. I think he's going to look gorgeous right beside this purple. So let's peel this up, probably killing my page. <laughs> this is why they're always so crinkly whenever I post my pictures. <laughs> I think I could peel that back just a little bit more. I should have definitely waited. I should have did this on the sticker paper, but oh well. I think he looks super gorgeous there. So, okay, let's go ahead and hmm, who should we do first? Should we work on you or should I put flowers behind the pink one? And what do I actually have to pick from? Like, I love those yellow ones. I do, but I don't think it's going to go with what I have on here right now. Might save those for like a purple yellow layout. I think that would look super gorgeous. So, okay, let's see here. And the more I try to put the box over this one, the more I realize like, I don't think this one's gonna look okay. So I'm gonna take the flower and I'm gonna overlap the box with this one. So we're gonna do some variety here. It's just the, these cute little pink ones and then the little purple dots. Like I don't wanna lose them if I cover them up. So let's go ahead and have you overlap. And now I just made like a really super wide sticker. Um, okay, this was my original plan here, but oh, it's looking funky to me now. So, okay, maybe this way, but then those boxes are really close to each other. So I think he has to go this way, which I kind of didn't want to do because I don't want all the teal on the bottom, but whatever guys it's going <laughs> and okay so now okay we just need a flower buddy for that pink box which you know i'm actually surprised this is going quite well it's going smoothly <laughs> you know what let's go ahead and add a little little foil branch up here on the top okay so he looks cute <laughs> that way i don't got like a bald spot there on the top and okay so these are exactly the same nothing changes on these pages so do what color do i want like i want that purple and yellow one i do but i think it would just look weird if it was just the only yellow thing on the page so i must stick with the purples pinks and teals and seeing that we have a teal flower in that box it looks like we are going with this purple and pink one so let's peel him back and okay so I want more of the purple to stick out even though he is the little guy and oops oh I went a little too far over oh god here we go <laughs> it's okay he can peel off the planner gods are with us today all right so just gotta move him over just a smidge and how about there and okay so that looks fantastic and guys i think i actually did it i think i created my very first wonderful looking flower layout
<laughs> See, anything is possible. And okay, so what? What quote do I want to start my week off with? And okay, so I'm kind of digging this one right here. The good vibes only. So yeah, good vibes only for Monday. <laughs> and what do you think? Like right here, kind of overlap them. I hope it looks okay. I hope it doesn't take away from the color of the flowers. And heck yeah, that is perfect. All right. And okay, so this one right here, be the good. That, it, I don't know, it just... It looks like it fits perfectly so yeah we're going with it so that's my Tuesday Wednesday box things are a little bit hectic by Wednesday so I just tend to uh, combine those <laughs> and okay so then I guess I have a Thursday Friday box so um, in one way I want to do stay positive but I feel like I already got that with the good vibes only and I mean I'm already being the good so maybe this should be like my balance out so this is going to be get shit done <laughs> and <laughs> see I like it at this bottom but then I feel like it's too much on this side it's not balanced out Ooh, I want to use you where do I put you and Oh my god, <laughs> my sleep schedule is all messed up. <laughs> okay, so I think I'm just going to go with my gut feeling and this was the first place I wanted to put it. So I think I'm going to surrender and I'm going to follow this sticker's advice and I'm going to get shit done and I'm just going to put it on the page. So yeah, right there, bam. Of course the final box already has a quote so he is going to stay untouched which leaves me with that bottom corner now what the heck do I do with that so I think I'm just gonna take a flower sticky and it's this beautiful purple one here if I could get it off of the page and we're just gonna put it in the corner <laughs> um, maybe have these coming I mean I really don't want to cover up too much of those bottom boxes as I said those are like very important it's like the most important part of this page but I think so it doesn't look funny I'm gonna to have to take it down into them a little bit and yeah we're just gonna pick another one of these quotes and we're gonna call it done and the have courage and be kind I'm gonna to have to say I think that's gonna be this week's motto <laughs> because we're going to need it <laughs> because something tells me this is going to be a very challenging week <laughs> so as much as I want to use those little baby flowers on the sidebar like I do and I want to add more of those little flowers okay maybe the leaves so <coughs> which again I am so sorry and I am so glad I'm in the house by myself right now <laughs> because <laughs> I would be getting some awkward looks um yeah back to these little leaves because they are adorable so just to spread some of that shimmy around because I noticed uh yeah some of these don't really have any shimmy so let's put some little leaves around these guys and okay so I think now we're gonna call it quits I think that's it I because in one way I want to use those little flowers I do I want to put them on the sidebar as markers but I'm just telling you I think less is more with this layout so that has that had to have been what I've been doing I guess incorrectly with the flower stickers in the past I've just like flower powered it to the max <laughs> So I'm digging this. It's super simple. It's cute and pretty. And let's go ahead and clean up our mess here because I really wasn't expecting to have this many books out. <laughs> it always ends up that way though. I mean, you're, you're, you're just like, yeah, I'm just going to use this one book. And then it's like 20 sticker books later. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and get these back in there. And whoops, forgot this guy. So, okay, that's it for there. Put these up here. I'm going to put you there and put the tools off to the side. 
And then I got to find my planner. Well, there's my trash. I gotta get that off the table. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't putting it in the trash can, guys. I was just throwing it to the side. <laughs> and okay, so see and look at Manchester's disc, which oh, this Happy Habits planner is seriously the most like like I hate to say prettiest, but it is. It's pretty. <laughs> super gorgeous and it's so simple too so yeah just to recap i used the fun floral sticker book the original colorful boxes and the tiny versions of fun florals and lovely pastels and of course um amxo's wonderful quote stickers so i'm just going to close out by saying thank you so much for watching i greatly appreciate it and please remember to hit the like button and subscribe to see more plan with me's.